Hello everybody, welcome back to the Kerbal Space Program. My name is Chris and today we are making a spaceship known as Endurance. Now this spaceship is from the film Interstellar by Christopher Nolan and if you haven't seen the film I do highly recommend it. Uh, I, I did see the film like a couple weeks ago and I, I was really stunned with the the scenery. I really love the scenery. Really great. Uh, there was one part where I was confused in the film, something like near the end with the black hole. Uh, and I had to do some research on that. But otherwise, like everything else was pretty much understandable. Um, I love the wormhole. The wormhole looks awesome. I must say, I'm looking for like a wallpaper of that as well. Pretty good. Um, anyway, so what we're making here again is the spaceship known as Endurance. And in the film, this is used for transporting the crew and a couple spaceships. Now, there's two spaceships that, or two types of spaceships that get docked with this Endurance spaceship. Um, and the two types are the Ranger, which is, as what I have here, it says it is a single stage planetary lift landing and lift off vehicle. That's the Ranger. And then you have the Lander, which is a heavy cargo shuttle. That's what it says here. Okay. Uh, yeah, so you got the two types of ships that dock onto this. Now, I've actually made the Ranger already and it works not that well and like I can't get it to lift off Kerbin's atmosphere yet so it's you know I'm kind of working on that it would take me like I don't know probably about an hour but anyways uh, we have that I won't be making the lander because to me it looks very lame and you know I don't even like lander screw the lander Ranger looks cool that's what we're doing and of course we have this endurance ship which um, I didn't really do much research into how to make rings, right? Because this is a circular spaceship and it's it's slightly different than what we usually have. And if you have seen the film, then you will remember, or hopefully you remember, that the the two spaceships that I'm talking about, the Ranger and the Lander, they, they actually dock in the very center of this Endurance spaceship. So you'll see we, we have a command module in the center and also two docking ports. So those two docking ports is where you, you will have the Ranger because in the actual spaceships, we have two Rangers. So yeah, that's great. Uh, yeah, let, let's talk about other things for now whilst whilst we do this. Uh, a while ago, we spoke about, I spoke about uh, making another intro and there's kind of different ideas on that. You know, I spoke to like a couple subscribers. The idea was we could either uh, use the same music that we have for the intro and just update the actual imagery. That's okay, but I would prefer to make something that's completely different. We could, and this is what I prefer, is essentially we just make a, a quick back, a, a black background with text that says, you know, heretic place, and then will then have an image of Kerbal Space Program, right? Maybe there's the logo. And that's quite a simple five second intro. Uh, the, in the problem with our intro right now is that it's quite fast paced. And, you know, you might actually, normally you would have to watch it a couple of times in order to even understand what you just saw because of how many images are just flashing there. So that's a problem with that. But anyway, I'll throw that out there. I'll probably work on the intro maybe in a couple of weeks time it depends on on a few things yeah because I'm, I'm working on a cinematic at the moment I've got a, a storyboard all worked out and I just have to quickly make some ships and use some mods and also keeping in mind in this game right now I'm I'm using the hot rockets mod I think that's what it's called let me quickly check just to make sure uh, yes hot rockets mod which is essentially it just changes the the sort of the animation of the rocket exhaust, as you can see. Uh, I, I don't know. I can't really remember what it looks like in stock. But anyway, I think I do think it's changed a little. So there we go. Um, yeah, just then we decoupled the the. Uh, oh man, I'm forgetting all the terminology here. Uh, we decoupled the rocket uh, fuel tanks. Yeah, and for whatever the reason, the rocket engines came off too. So that, that's a little unusual. Maybe they weren't placed on properly. <laughs> That's weird. Uh, yeah, so we're getting into space. They took, this took me about, I think, two hours total. Maybe a little longer than that, but definitely no more than three hours to complete this. And of course, you know, obviously we had to do testing uh, to make sure that 
this thing actually has structural integrity. So had to keep that in mind. But anyway, this is essentially done. This is working. Our next episode, we will I'll be making the Ranger, and you guys will will see the Ranger attached to this uh, this ship ship here. And yeah, that'll be it. So I do hope you guys enjoyed. See you next time. Take care.